What is up, guys? It's me, Dan. We're back, John. How are you? So, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get Project 64 without admin privileges. So, as you can see, I've got my Project 64 right here running on a no admin PC. Yeah, these would be like pro perfect controls for me if they actually like worked well for me. Yeah, um, like I said, this is super good. Um, the reason why it's going so fast is because I have one of FPS off. If you take, if you turn it on, as you see, like this. This is going in, but I'm just going to end the information real quick. Now, what you're going to do, you're going to download that zip file from the link in the description and take out the 64 portable project 64 out and put it on your desktop, and it should look like this right here. Um, I'm going to put it in the description, or you can just go to my Discord and download it if you're already in there. Click on it. Click on it. I have a few ROMs in there. Just click open on here. You can add your own ROMs in a folder. Go up to file. Um, this is gonna pop up. It always does. It's really annoying, right? You hit this prompt, right? So yeah. Um, if you pay for Project 64, um, yeah. If you pay for Project 64, you don't get this for that 30 seconds, but it's it's not worth it. it it's not worth it. Why? Why would you pay for that just to get 30 seconds out? But, yeah, what you're going to do is you're going to go up to file, you're going to click choose ROM directory. Then you're just going to go over here, so it's going to look like this. Just go all the way down, click right here on that folder, click on the ROMs. Click right here, otherwise you just drag a ROM over and it'll start up. But you're going to go up to options now and you're just going to click on controller plug plugin. Now, I can't stress this enough. It's going to have my settings. It, it's going to have my settings, right? It's, it's going to have my settings, right? We're going to just click clear controller and then, yeah. And then you're going to click save and then when you're in the game, I'm going to go on the Super Smash Bros. Fuck it, doesn't matter. So as you can see, if you have, if you have more than FPS off. I'm gonna have it off. I don't know why it's super bad right now, but it's never usually like this. But if your audio fucks up, then your picture's bad. Yep. Yeah, if you play Super Smash Bros, all you gotta do is do this, and it's and that's just B basically. You know, spaces, spaces A, F is nothing. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I actually don't have a jump right now. It surely sucks. But, yeah. Um, yeah. How you go on the full screen? Just gonna click System. You're just going to pull the options, click full screen, it's going to push in the full screen, as you can see. Click escape to get out of full screen, and yeah. That's basically all I really wanted to say, that's all I really wanted to say, but I'm also going to be promoting this Project 64, I mean this uh, free craft right here, so if you're into Minecraft modding, this is made by Phoenix Arc, alright, Phoenix Arc, he's in something Discord, as you can see this is his name right here. Give you guys his Discord tag, drag Steven. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna go to update, click no, and then you're just gonna click yeah, click connect, type in your PSU's IP address, it'll say this right here, but since I didn't put my thing in there, it's gonna say that, fortunately, is the host op non host options are really good, but if you want moderate, if you want to fly, just click moderator flight, and yeah, it's gonna let you fly, but yeah, yeah, so yeah, um, for the name changer, what you're gonna do is you're gonna change the name, and then go into the game, can't just change the name in the game like in GTA. But yeah, I just wanted to note that I'll also be You have to go to my Discord. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm going to have to say, 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 I'm going to